Blessed Christmas Eve, everyone. This is a special amateurish, which of course all my videos are amateurish, uh, but sincere Christmas greeting on Christmas Eve from Florida. And uh, indeed, I am going to show you around my house inside and outside to give you a flavor of what Christmas is going to be like here. Not quite what it was last year where I decorated the house with lots of lights outside uh, because I was home. You guys all know that I recently returned from Africa. Next week, I'm heading to Phoenix to minister to the poor Clares in Tonopata, cloistered poor Clares. And so I'm only home for a short period of time. So kind of like a, a moderated uh, Christmas, but still I want to offer you the joy, the blessings, the love, the mercy of this Christmas season. And you're going to see as I bring you around the house, the emphasis on the Holy Family, on the Nativity. You guys know that I wrote a prayer to the Holy Family to protect families, to protect all of us from all attacks against life, marriage, and family. <clears throat> now, this is a little Holy Family that I bought several years ago. It was in a globe. Um, it uh, The globe uh, got broke, uh, but uh, unfortunately, uh, the Holy Family is untouched the nativity scene. It's much smaller than it looks right now, uh, but uh, uh, one of my uh, uh, cherished possessions uh, that I bought actually, I think right after I moved here, the first Christmas I moved here two and a half years ago in the end of August 2021. So let me uh, bring you around. You hear some Christmas music in the background. And I'm going to just show you a little flavor of what Christmas is here. And then I'm going to tell you uh, the Christmas gift that I have for all of you uh, this uh, Christmas season. Those of you who have encouraged me, those of you who have supported me, those of you who have prayed for me. Uh, every year I try to give all of you something. As St. Peter said, silver and gold I do not have, but what I do have, I want to give to you. So I'm Father Stephen Imbrato, protestchildkilling.com. There's the featured link. You can subscribe to my Rumble and YouTube channel. But let's uh, get going uh, and let me show you around and uh, give you uh, this Christmas greeting. And then this, this video is not going to be long. It's not going to be long. I want it purposely to be short so that uh, more and more people will watch it. So I love you. And uh, here we go. So I want to start off by saying that um, Christmas Day tomorrow and then Monday, the Feast of St. Stephen and Tuesday, the Feast of St. John the Evangelist, which was my mother's birthday. I'm going to celebrate a triduum of masses for all of you. That's my Christmas gift to all of you. Three masses, Christmas Day, Feast of St. Stephen and the Octave of Christmas, and then uh, St. John the Evangelist, because then uh, Wednesday I will be leaving for Tuesday, Wednesday. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, yes, Wednesday I'll be leaving for Phoenix. And then uh, for the rest of the week, it might be difficult to celebrate Mass. But anyway, uh, let me uh, turn this camera around and show you uh, what the house is like. Now, that's my Christmas tree. All right, let me um, give you a close up. People who send me pictures of their family uh, get prominent places on the tree. I love that. So that's my tree. I don't know if you can see the lights are lit right now. Oh, yeah, it's blinking, the, the red star. 
All right, so I'm proud of... Now, one of the things that you may or may not be able to see, but there's ornaments from my travels all over uh, the world. All right, and I can't show them all to you, but um, uh, Our Lady La Leche, New Mexico. Uh, there's a couple from uh, Africa here. Uh, just uh, ornaments from all over the world. All right, a couple of tacky things that I have received from people over the years. I have a couple of angels. Now, this was a gift given to me by a dear friend, Teresa. And this is an 18th, uh, 1800, 19th century icon. All right, this is the first nativity scene, All right, right here. One of my original nativity scenes. I have several, and I'm going to show them to you. All right. Let's uh, move along. All right, you can see Maud and Maurice's and my stockings, all right, hanging from the mantle, some of my little religious art. I'm very proud of the fact that uh, I have developed a green thumb and my plants are flourishing. Now over here, oh, so here is a picture of me and St. John Paul II, one of my prized possessions and then uh, different uh, little icons and knickknacks. These are not necessarily Christmas, uh, but these are little knickknacks that I am proud of. Of course, Mother Teresa, uh, I am a big fan of Mother Teresa, Our Lady of America, a blessing by Pope Benedict, uh, another gift given to me uh, that in regards to uh, Maria Goretti, uh, one of my favorite saints, St. Bernadette. So uh, this is um, kind of like a potpourri of uh, blessings that I have received. Some of the uh, sacred art that I have. Again, Holy Family, Our Lady Undoer of Knots. This I got from my mother's estate, Mary, Queen of Angels. All right, some more of the Christmas tree I'll show you. Let me see now. This is a, a globe. I, uh, I have a, a, an ornament of my deceased son who took his own life, dear friend Cindy. All right, let's continue over here. There's Maurice. Maurice, say Merry Christmas to everybody. <laughs> you see, I have a little boom box. So that's all the music I can play other than maybe off of YouTube on my TV, but let me turn this up a little bit. See the rosaries everywhere. Pray to rosary every day. Here is uh, one of the globes that I really enjoy. Santa. Uh, the three wise men on their way, on their way. Of course, that goes to the nativity scene that I've already showed you. All right, let's uh, continue around the house, and I'm going to take you outside and show you some of the other uh, Christmas orientation that I have. Here are some candles that I have, a Santa candle. Here's a neat one, Santa adoring uh, the baby Jesus, and then, of course, a beautiful card. These are the cards that were giving me. Uh, and again, you see St. Joseph, the icon, Our Lady of America, Our Lady of America.com, Our Lady of America.com. I talk about that all the time. More cards that I've received. I just planted these uh, two cuttings into this pot. We'll see if they take. And then, of course, uh, Trip and uh, Our Lady of Guadalupe. Here's Nellie Edwards, a mother with child. Another icon of uh, Mary and uh, the Blessed Mother. Jesus blessing us. Yes, Jesus blesses us even in our sinfulness, uh, hoping that, of course, we come to daily conversion. All right, so I'm going to take you outside now. All right, again, there's the tree by the front door. People can see it from the outside. I don't know where Maud is. Maud might be outside, so let's go see. All right, but now this is my screened-in porch. And you see another nativity scene here. A couple of uh, Christmas plaques. There is the uh, wise men on their way 
to uh, be with the child Jesus for the Feast of the Epiphany. I won't be around. All right, some more plantings here. All right, I hang out here quite often. It's about probably 65 degrees today. It's a little bit overcast. All right, Our Lady of Sorrows. All right, little Christmas globe. My grill, yeah. All right, now we're going to go outside here. Now this little, there's Santa. Santa's almost here. There's Maud. You see Maud over there? All right, Maud's going to be doing her business. All right, the dogs are so good, they never stray away. All right, so this is a little lit up uh, uh, manger scene, a wooden manger scene that I got several years ago. And uh, let's go out into the grass here. And, of course, you guys are familiar with this who follow me, uh, the statue of the Holy Family. I wrote a prayer to the Holy Family asking the Holy Family to uh, protect all of us, all families, from all attacks against life, marriage, and family. That gets lit up every single night. And then uh, here we have uh, the manger scene that gets lit up every single night too there it is beautiful uh, almost life-size manger scene and a couple of lights here so at night that gets lit up and uh, i have the blessed virgin mary over in the background there a gift from my neighbor who just moved away so this is my humble abode all right and again uh, I, I live on a cul-de-sac let me show you all right nice little cul-de-sac uh, an elderly, well, not elderly, I mean, they're younger than me, probably. Um, Marilyn and Ken live at the, the end of the cul-de-sac. Uh, Jake and Abby just moved in to where Donna and Jackson were. And then we have uh, Kaylee and Ethan live there. They just have a newborn baby, first Christmas with their baby. That's exciting. And so these are my neighbors. So it's a quiet little neighborhood. Uh, it's a neat place. I'll show you. I have uh, the uh, Spanish moss on the great uh, oak tree. Uh, a couple of other uh, big trees around uh, the house. So that's my humble abode, right? And you can see how important the Holy Family is to me, the nativity scene. And I want to wish you all a merry, merry, merry Christmas, uh, a blessed, blessed New Year. I want to thank you for your love, your encouragement, your support and prayers. And, uh, and I'm just so blessed to have you all in my life. I love yous. There's Maurice waiting for me to come back into the house. Maud's out doing her business. Maud is feeling pretty good. She suffers from diabetes, completely blind now, but she's doing pretty well. All right, and again, and again, I am going to be celebrating Mass tomorrow for all of you for Christmas and also the Feast of St. Stephen, and also the Feast of St. John of the Evangelist, my mother's birthday, a Triduum of Masses for all of you. That is my gift to you. Let's just take a moment and listen to this uh, beautiful music by the Hanson Singers. Again, Merry Christmas, Blessed New Year, and uh, again, silver and gold I don't have, but what I do have I give to you, my daily prayers, three Masses, although all of you are in my prayers each and every single day. You guys know I celebrate a live Mass every day. I uh, do this live where we pray. Uh, we have in spirit, amen, and now let us consecrate. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb. Be mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee we send up our sighs, mourning and weep in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, those eyes of mercy towards us. 
And after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, a Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Again, I'm Father Stephen Imbrato of ProtestChildKilling.com, ProtestChildKilling.com. Wishing you all a merry, merry Christmas, a blessed New Year's. I love you. Go out into the world today, my friend, this Christmas season and New Year, and give them heaven.